Hi guys, what's up? Uh, I know long time no see. Uh, today, after really a long time, I'm going to do a sit down video that I'm very excited and pumped up about. So let's just begin that. What I'm going to do in this video is that I'm going to uh, show you some books, some self help books, and then uh, I'm going to tell a little about uh, that book keeping the excitement of reading that book. So yeah, let's go. But before that, I have three things as a disclaimer, maybe. The first one is that uh, I am also a beginner. So if you are a beginner, high five. I have just started the uh, habit of reading books since uh, just like past few months. Uh, second is that the books that I'm going to show you, some of them or like most of them are, uh, you may have seen them in some book recommendation video. As I told you that I'm a beginner, so I have watched those book recommendation video and then collected a few books here to show you. The third thing is that I have only self uh, growth books here. That doesn't mean that I don't like fiction or I hate fiction. Fiction to padna hi nahi I am not saying that. It's just that I'm sharing uh, about few books that I have read and coincidentally all of them are self-help books because I have started uh, from there. I would read fiction letter. Now, after finishing all of this, let's see our first book which is uh, this Topper Study Hack by Avinash Agarwal. If you are a student, not matter where uh, are you from school, college or maybe competitive exam or anything. If you are a student, I would 100% recommend this book to buy and read whenever you feel there is a problem. I'm just giving you a glimpse. It have uh, some tips about memorizing plans, when to sleep, how much to sleep, how many hours to sleep, uh, like everything, uh, morning study, night study, every doubt that we face, this book has solution. This book is for 249 uh, rupees. And if you can afford this book, please buy this and read this actually when you face. The main purpose of buying books is to read, of course. The main two or three reasons I would ask you to uh, read this book is first that uh, I think the author has also mentioned in this book that he had interviewed students like us. He have pointed out the problems we face. Second, it have literally every solution. I'm telling you, it have literally every solution. Third, the language of this book is very simple. It's not a very tough vocabulary book. So, so any of you who knows basic English can read this book. And believe me, it's a must buy book. I'm saying you it's a must buy book. Let's move on to our next book, uh, which many people recommend, which is uh, Ikigai. The face looks like this. The cover looks like this. Okay, so this book is written by Hector Ga... Sorry, I'm going to pronounce the name wrong. So there are two friends who wrote this book who live in Japan. And this book is about the culture of Japan. Why the people from Japan are so... Japan, Japan, whatever. Are so young and uh, how they find the purpose. Basically, Ikigai means for the purpose of your life. The purpose for which you live. Uh, you have to follow your Ikigai. The first, I think the first thing that I found that this book suggests is that you have to find your own Ikigai. You have to find your own purpose. The reason why you should buy this book is that first it is very light reading. I mean, it's not heavy reading like it's not like that. It's very simple, easy. You will uh, get a lot of interest to read this. At least I did. So that's what I'm telling you uh, through my experience. Um, of course, it is also a must buy 280 rupees uh, if you could. About this book in Hindi because my mother prefers reading books in Hindi over English. So that's why it is in Hindi for me. But you can of course buy in English, Hindi, whichever language you prefer the most. I have pretty much told you what I wanted to now i have a um, i have a hack for you in the last of this video so you could save a little bit money that's what i used i would tell you in the last the third one is the most famous book in this world which is uh, probably which is how to win and influence people now uh, bye 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 by the author del Carne uh, carnegie there should be a reason that why it's the best seller book and it is being printed from like 75 years ago if you have not read this book this book talk about of course through the title you get that this book basically overall deals about uh, how you can make friends and then influence them by whatever you say your action so some of the tips that i mentioned in in this book is that smile when you talk to others not like hamesa smile but of course keep a genuine smile then be genuinely interested in whatever they are saying for example if we are communicating then uh, when i'm speaking listen to me or uh, listen not me but like everybody and then be genuinely interested uh, reply them hmm, okay i understand like those kind of words as i have told you that i'm just going to tell you a little about all of those books so you have the excitement to read the real book or listen to an audio book of that book whatever it is the fourth book is uh, the subtle art of not giving a 
F. Uh, this is written by Mark Manson. This book has been also recommended by most of the people. The reason that why I like this book, the basic thing is in this uh, book you will find from the first chapter is do not worry about a lot about things. Let it be. Sorry, the battery has been low. Uh, not worry about things and let it. be how it is going like uh, this book is really very helpful for those who worry a lot about exams i am a student so i am uh, seeing through the perspective of a student um, maybe for example my mother worry a lot so this book is for her uh, um, and what kind of uh, why i get through this book is that the writer is very chill and kind of okay like i i really love this book this is like a very interesting to read um personally i felt the vibe of the writer that i was very you know that's what kept me going uh, reading this book so yeah that's about this book one thing on which i want your advice is that i want to make a video for all the readers who are beginner uh, that i was a few months ago now uh, through that journey i have some tips to share with you and believe me they those tips are really helpful for someone who has just started reading books so tell me if you want a video for that i would make that and now mindset written by dr carol s dweek this one is my favorite this book is written by a woman that i was very happy about basically the idea in this book is about a fixed mindset and then growth mindset by the word that's fixed and growth you can you could understand i think you have the idea of what's what is there basically you can learn a lot of things from uh, this book as the cover says that essential reading for anyone with aspiration so if you have aspiration you should read this book i personally found as i told it's my favorite so i personally found it very relatable you can say i found it very relatable because uh, before reading this book i was i was thinking a lot about mindset so at that time reading that book has really got me should you read this book of course if you uh, are someone who never have focused on what they think and how, about their mindset uh, then this book is something that they should read like they should should read personally i think that i have growth mindset uh, uh, this book have also some tests that you can give um just read this book i'm just going to say it itna hi i'm now i'm tired <laughs> just two books left i have not completed any of the book totally but i have read like half of them half of the pages or like less than half because i have academics also so it's i whenever i get just like those free time then i read the next book is on time management the book is named as time management and this is written by uh, author dr sudhir dikshit if you could see the title now again this is in hindi because my mother bought it and i just stole it from her because it was interesting because it's just like itna patla sa book hai and when you are bored of reading these heavy books khaskar this book that i'm going to tell you after this uh, if you could see uh, it's very thin so it's like you can fix you can read it in, uh, like just a few uh, hours not at one sitting of course it would be stupidity i think for reading a book in just one sitting that would be boring i guess okay so this as the title mentions this book talks about how to manage your time and it has really effective uh, tips and tricks to manage for example it talks about um, it first ask you three question i'm not going to tell you what are those three questions but if you would read this book you would find then it says to log uh, log your time on in a notebook that i was doing before reading this book so i am very happy about uh, myself and then there are many tips on how to manage time this is not a very recommended uh, book from my side but this uh, i think whatever this book has said you can find in a youtube video if you watch on time management uh, but still i re- i i added this book because it's very thin and it's very you know it's it would not take a lot of time at the same time the book is uh, fine it's it's good Finally the last book is here which is the psychology of money uh, let me tell you the author the author is Morgan Housel H O U S E L now i don't earn money but i'm reading this book because some day i'm going to earn i hope very soon okay this book talks about how to manage money and literally about everything for example the first thing that i highlighted was that every the financial decision that we make depends on our background from where we belong and from like us time stocks kya the ya fir us time uh, finance pure world ka kya tha hamare country ka kya tha it all depends on all of that or those things and that was something i never thought and the first thing was that okay so let me tell you a funny thing what happens with me is that uh, whenever the a book come from amazon i just like tear it and sanitize of course due to this corona 
देन आई आई लाइक लेट्स रीड दिस लेट्स रीड दिस क्या है एक्साइटमेंट एक्साइटमेंट की वजह से द फर्स्ट टाइम आई रेड दिस बुक एवरी थिंग वॉज लाइक फ्राम हेयर टू हेयर आई डिड नॉट अंडरस्टूड एनी थिंग इट इज़ नॉट लाइक दैट इट इज़ वेरी हेवी बुक सो आई टुक अ ब्रेक फ्राम दिस बुक एंड आफ्टर लाइक वन और टू मंथ अगेन आई स्टार्टड रीडिंग दिस बुक एंड दिस टाइम आई हैड इंटरेस्ट इन रीडिंग दिस so uh, this could help you taking a break maybe so in the middle of video i said you that i'm going to uh, give you a little hack that I, that you can try um, that hack is uh, if you go to amazon there is a combo or like the combo of two books five books i prefer buying the combo uh, rather than just one book the price of uh, of uh, the combo will be less than the price of individual both of them so what that is something that i do and i think i should share with you that's what we have talked about in this video if you found it really helpful like this video if you really like this if you don't then please don't like and subscribe so see you thank you so much for watching this video